All right, welcome back into usdtoreros.com. Getting set now for the home opener in the 2012 campaign. We are joined by head coach Ron Carragher. Coach, you go on the road last week against a scholarship opponent. Hang with them for three quarters in the end. Cal Poly just too much. Now you come back home against Western New Mexico for the home opener. Tell us about how you're looking coming right here to Torero Stadium. Well, it's always good to come home, play a home game here. Uh, school opened up this week. Classes started. So hopefully we get a good crowd uh, support from our students. But real excited. Our players coming back home playing in our stadium and uh, just looking to get back on track here. It was a tough, uh, tough loss. I thought we competed well for, for three quarters and then the fourth quarter just got away. But uh, looking back, uh, you get playing a home game here in Torero Stadium. Yeah, six-point game after three quarters a week ago. Let's begin as we look ahead to this week now with your defense. Uh, you know, Blake Oliar didn't get a chance to really showcase himself because it was a triple option offense last week. I thought Zach Dunay had a great ball game. He's your leading returning tackler. Tell us about what those two guys bring. They bring so much uh, experience athletic ability, uh, tenacious effort throughout the game. They're leaders on defense and uh, we rely on them uh, and yeah, they uh, they both we're going to need them throughout the season uh, for the defense to play at a high level to continue their play and, and they, they got off to a good start week one. Both played very solid games. It may not always reflect in the statistic column but uh, they both played well and looking forward to uh, seeing them from here on out. Tell us about your running back rotation. You got three great backs now. Darian Hancock, the freshman from Helix, Joe Ferguson the transfer, Kenny James, you know you were from his great MVP-like season. Tell us about your three running backs heading into this week. A uh, good group there. I, I like having uh, depth at that position because they do take such a pounding, uh, uh, whether they're carrying the ball, whether they're pass protecting, uh, blocking as a lead back. Uh, so I, I think we have a, a good trio there in those three. Uh, they'll be competing. They'll be getting opportunity. Looks like they'll they'll probably balance their playing time amongst the three of them and see who has the hot hand and, and kind of go with it from there. I thought your receivers played really well on the road at Cal Poly. Low Logan Smith, Reggie Bell coming back here. Brandon White, we know what he can do. Sam Hoekstra as well. Uh, I think you had a pretty good core wide receivers there. We do have a good group. Uh, it's great getting Reggie back, uh, having missed last year, redshirting the 2012 season, uh, it's, it's, or red 2011 season. Great getting him back. Um, Brandon White can uh, build off that season that he had. Sam Hoekstra led our team in receptions, had a very solid game. And then Logan Smith, a uh, freshman from Folsom, California, really off to a good start. So uh, those are four guys. Uh, fifth one, D'Angelo. Barksdale, who's made the conversion from quarterback. So we do have a good group of wideouts. Hopefully we can continue to uh, build off that. Tell us about Western New Mexico. You played them last year at home, got a 20-point victory. Uh, first time going to get in this series going. Tell us about your opponent. Uh, they're a, a, a good athletic team uh, on the offensive side. They've got a receiver. They've, a quarterback throws the ball well. They run the ball hard. Good running back. Uh, they do a variety of things on the offensive side of the ball to, to uh, Get the def never let the defense settle in on a certain type. Last year, we're, last week, we're playing a triple option team, and that's who they were. But uh, they do a lot of things at, at Western New Mexico. On the defensive side, a lot of athletes on the back end. Uh, very, you see good speed in the the back seven. Uh, their front guys rush hard. They they create a, a lot of issues with their blitzing that they do from their their three man front. So uh, our hands will be full, and our guys know it. Uh, so we need to finish out a good week of preparation for Saturday's game. You know, turnovers are so important. You know, turnover margin might be the number one factor in any football game, whether it's win or loss this year. I think that's something you maybe look at coming into this week. Definitely. Uh, can't be uh, uh, losing the turnover battle week in and week out. And, you know, in college football, you see a, a parallel to the winning teams with the ones who win the turnover ratio. And uh, we are obviously at the losing end last week, and we need to, to get back on track, uh, you know, create create some turnovers on the defensive side and then offensive uh, side, great ball security and and uh, make good decisions with our throws. Well, Coach, you see behind us here, I mean, this gorgeous field on display here for your home opener. Good luck and thank you very much. Thank appreciate you. it. Appreciate it, Jack. Thank you. Head Coach Ron Kerger there. We will continue on much more here to come. USDTorreros.com.